everybody, and my name is Alex. So firstly, if you look at this picture, you may see the words AI. You may not know what it means, but right, it's actually what you're using right now. Yep. If you're watching this video with maybe a tablet or an iPhone or a laptop, you are using technology. And inside that technology, things escalate quickly. Because soon, uh, just after that, ChatGPT was created. And other AI platforms was created too. So, for example, you may not know what this means, but AI is called artificial intelligence. That means that artificial is like robotic, like maybe robots. And robots that have intelligence. You may not get what I'm thinking, but by the end of this video, you may know what I'm thinking. So, firstly, if you look at this mind map right now, you can just literally see how it will change AI, will change the world. So, will it change the world? If you don't know AI, well, you should better look at after it. Because in soon, not too long in the future, almost everybody in the world may be using it. Yep, almost everybody. Not one, not two, not a million people, not a thousand people. But maybe like two to three billion people. Almost half the world may use it at some point. And right now, literally everybody's using it. You just log into Log into your iPhone and iPad and boom, you just see everybody using iPhone and iPad and everywhere they're using. And sometimes this may get a little farther. That's what I'm talking about, AI. So recently I've learned a app on my Google search engine. You just type in chat GBT, chat GBT. So, so basically what it means like, so it can chat with you. Like, it's a robot. You may feel like it's just a human talking to you. A harmless human doing nothing, just talking to you. But it's not that. Artificial intelligence. Think about that word again. Robots that think, that have intelligence, that have minds, and that can think. Like people. Really, like, what if it just says, oh my God, look at this new app. It can help me with my homework. And that's exactly true. If we just write, write three reasons why bullying is bad, just like some random stuff on it. You could just say everything you want and it chat GPT will uh, explain to you. That is the deadly future of AI and how it will change the world. Now let's get a quick picture of this mind map. First network, so there are no jobs needed anymore after AI will change the world. You may notice, but AI is slowly taking over the world. So for example, in banks long ago, there are just people like, hey, okay, I'll give you the money. Yeah, I'll save your money like that. But now ChatGPT, Sorry, not check GBT again. So, other robot platforms and, that work inside the banks are now literally taking over. And then they're just, okay, here we go. I'll save your money inside this account. That's it. Usually, banks now are more developed. Now, just think about this. I also heard a book called 21st Lessons from the 21st century. So, you you heard it right, like, like right now, the future is literally taking over the world. So, for example, there are millions of taxi drivers in the world, right? But in the future, all of them will be robots. Yep. If you just say something like a simple task, just give me a cup of water, AI will agree. Yeah. Uh, I will even. Even if the funniest thing ever, like, hug me. Okay. So, even if you say the funniest thing ever, 
AI will do it for you. Not people that will bully you and are mean and they just say, no, I will not do that for you. But AI will just agree. They'll do whatever they want for you. Like, for example, there's a big difference behind AI and people. And a lot of people don't notice it. So, firstly, the first example is that AI literally just literally just acts the same as normal people do. Now, think again. So, what are you thinking? I know you're thinking about, oh, okay, I'm really worried about AI. We'll soon to get to that later. So, let's move on to the next point. So, AI will do all the work for you. They'll just literally use, we'll just literally use money. And we'll copy like the useless class. But let's not get onto it. People will use, lose money. After I read the 21st, uh, 20, 21 lessons from the 21st century book, and I heard about it, it says that when we get to the future, AI will dominate the world and will do any, everything for you. Literally everything. So right now, the useless class, which is called in that story. So the useless class will just take over the world. There will be no jobs at all and AI will impact the world. So the useless class, I just said, you could do whatever you want and literally just get some money from the government or get a little whatever but you can also start coding and making videos and doing all your hobbies and what you want now i don't want to be too serious about this ai is not going to destroy the world and destroy all humans so that they will die all over the world it won't be that much impact ai is created so that people in the world can make life better not to harm people and do not do it so they are ai is willing to help people other people are saying it's dangerously good and it is sort of that but at first ai is just a harmless thing but if you go inside deeper into it, you can see what it really is. No minds, nothing at all. Nope, nothing. So let's move on to this. Look into the future. Now, what do you see? Yep, all I just talked about before, there will be no jobs, unemployment stuff. Yeah, AI will take over the world. But there is some hope. People will still get money from the government if they trust the government. And they will also have AI to help. They will have AI to help all their homework and do whatever they want. I don't know in the future what it will look like. AI and robots destroying the city and aliens coming to invade the world. Never mind that. Or just robots helping each other and communicating to have a friendly world. Or do people have to move to a new planet? I don't know. We'll find out in the future. That's, that's for today's video and bye.